Hello, I'm Daniil, and welcome to the Imona Project. We here at the Imona Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to inspiration, information, education, guidance to uh, converts, to Noahides, and to Balishova, people returning to, um, to Judaism. Um, and I want to share a very brief little um, anecdote uh, on the subjects of um, humility, and um, Pashtus, simplicity. Uh, the Hasidim uh, placed a great emphasis on not only Amuna, faith in God, but on Emes and Pashtus, on, on truth and simplicity. And for many years, uh, Hasidish Rebbe, uh, by the name of Rabbi Moshe Chaim Ephraim, this, this was a, a grandson of the Baal Shem Tov. Uh, when they were young, when they were just married, uh, he and his wife, the Rebetzin, lived in, uh, in great poverty. And on, uh, on Shabbos Eve, on her Shabbos, she would put two small white candles into uh, candle holders that she herself had made out of clay. That's all they could afford. Um, later, they grew more wealthy. They were more comfortable. One uh, Shabbos uh, night, coming home from, from the synagogue, he comes into the house and he sees on the dining room table two beautiful uh, candlesticks, silver. They were just stunningly gorgeous. And his wife was standing there, beaming with pride. Um, and, and, and great joy. Because this was, this, in her mind, this is what Shabbos was all about. The glorification of Shabbos. Now we have some decent candlesticks, isn't it nice? And uh, Rabbi Moshe Chaim Ephraim um, looked at the, candle, uh, at the candlesticks and he said, That looks all very nice and bright. Uh, to you, but, my dear, to me, all looked nice and bright in uh, our days gone by. Rabbi Moshe Ephraim Chaim was perfectly happy with the simple, authentic, joyful Shabbos that he and his young bride used to have when all they had were those two tiny little clay candle holders that his wife made. Um, it is nice to, 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 to have nice things, to glorify a mitzvah. That's, that's not a bad thing. That's a good thing. But uh, let us not lose sight of the fact that these objects that we use to make a mitzvah more beautiful. They help the mitzvah. They're not the mitzvah. Um, if you have beautiful silver candlesticks, great. If you have two little um, tea light candles, great. It's the lighting of the Shabbos candles. It's that mitzvah. It's that welcoming of the Sabbath. That's what's important. And uh, those two little clay candlesticks meant just as much to Rebbe Moshe Chaim Ephraim uh, than any silver candlesticks uh, his wife could ever buy. Uh, we're going to be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Immortal Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you too much.